Today we will be reviewing proper finger and palm print capture techniques to ensure high quality print image collection. We will use a L-Scan palm scanner mounted in a workstation cabinet for this demonstration. However, the same flat and rolled techniques can be applied when utilizing the Guardian 10 print scanner. Before we begin, here are some helpful definitions and items to take note of. Platen. The platen refers to the fingerprint capture surface. Silicone membrane. This is the silicone pad that covers the glass capture surface. Guide marks. These are the graphic indicators on the housing around the platen that provide guidance for finger placement. Capture area. As indicated by the guide marks, this is the capture area for flat and rolled fingerprints. This is the capture area when imaging palm prints on the L-Scan. Ergonomic staging of any live scan device is a step that should not be neglected. The FBI and other fingerprint capture experts recommend that the capture surface or platen of the device should be located 44 to 46 inches above the floor when capturing prints from a standing object. It is recommended that the operator stand behind the subject being printed and that the subject stand perpendicular to the live scan device extending their arm. This is to ensure that the operator has control of the subject's hand and that the subject's hand can be easily and comfortably rotated for roll print capture. The operator should instruct the subject to completely relinquish control of their hand and not attempt to assist during the capture procedure. When capturing 10 print flats, start by taking an overhand grasp of the subject's hand just behind or over the knuckles. It may be necessary to turn the subject's hand at a 15 degree angle before placing on the platen. Guide the fingers over and down on the platen and within the guide mark. Be sure to include from the end of the finger to the first crease of each finger on the platen without pressing too hard or cropping the top or sides. You can use your other hand or fingertips to apply slight pressure to the top of the subject's hand until you hear the auto capture beep from the scanner. Let's observe the hand grasp technique that is recommended for capturing rolled prints of each finger and thumb. By reaching well over the subject's hand, you will be able to comfortably turn the wrist while maintaining a slight even pressure on the fingertip you are rolling. Use the index and middle finger of your other hand to ensure a good even roll. Capturing fingerprints using the nail to nail method. Notice how the operator is able to grasp the hand. Isolate the finger and place it on its side on the platen. The operator then smoothly rolls from nail edge to nail edge in one motion. The same procedure is used for rolling thumbs as well as fingers. Capturing fingerprints using the rock and roll method. To avoid uneven pressure lines across your captured image, notice first in this example that the finger is first placed down on the platen, then rolled to the side. This method is called the rock and roll nail to nail method and will help you to maintain an even pressure throughout the rolling procedure. Palm images are only captured on the L-Scan device. When capturing palm print images on the L-Scan, the procedure is to separately capture the upper, lower, and writer's palm images in that order. When capturing the upper palm, notice how the operator grasps the subject's hand and uses their fingers to push the subject's thumb down and perpendicular to the fingers as they guide the hand to the platen surface. When capturing the lower palm, Place the subject's wrist or face of the hand on the platen edge. Use your other hand to lay the subject's palm and fingers out on the platen. It is often necessary to apply pressure to the top of the hand to flatten out the lower palm. Printing the writer's palm requires grasping the subject's hand at the wrist and guiding the hand over the platen. Notice in this example how the operator places the palm on the platen and slightly angles the hand inward to ensure complete capture. To review, in this video we have noted common live scan terminology as well as demonstrated how to ergonomically stage a live scan device, position the subject for print capture, grasp the subject's hand, 
capture 10 print flats, and capture rolled prints using two techniques, nail to nail and rock and roll. For additional training, to order maintenance supplies or learn more about the full line of LiveScan devices, please visit our website at